How you all doing guys, Brandon here. Welcome back to Retro Dodo. Now this is a slightly different product today. It's not a handheld, it's not anything really nostalgic, but it is a piece of art based around a retro gaming product that I just had to share with you. And the good guys over at Grid sent this out to unbox, to showcase to you guys, because I do think a lot of you will enjoy this. I know what you're thinking, Brandon, you're unboxing art now? You have to take a look at this. So this is basically a piece of art based around a PSP 1000 and they've basically disassembled it and made it a piece of art that looks absolutely sick. And they've sent over a few products actually, the PSP being the first one, but it is the one I am most excited about. And from what I can tell, this is as far as I've got, the packaging actually looks incredible. Now, I'm gonna take this out and it, whoa, okay. That packaging is ridiculous. So they've got melted wax with their logo on it and looks like it's packaged very well. And so I'm moving office in a couple months and this is something I've been keeping my eye on and what I want up in the office. And I think a lot of you will enjoy it as well. I think the company's fairly new as well. Uh, there are links below for you to check them out, but check out this. I'm just gonna rip into it. So this is the PSP 1000 disassembled into an incredible piece of art. Like you've got the shoulder buttons, the joysticks, the main board, the optical drive, the front shell, wow. So this is the board that it's stuck onto. Look at that. Wow, I've never seen anything quite like this. And this is perfect for any of you that have like a retro or a gaming cave. Uh, this is the first one they've done in terms of a handheld. So I'm excited to show it off. They do do other um, bits of tech, which I'll show you in a bit, but I am just blown away with that at the moment. Okay, so this is the next one I want to share with you and the PSP is the only retro gaming product they do, but they also do retro tech as well. Look at this. So this is the old school iPhone 4S, look at that. Oh my God, I remember having this phone back in the day and now just being able to look at it in a, in a dissembled way, in a piece of art that will go beautifully in anyone's office. It's even got Steve Jobs' signature down there. Like these aren't brand new iPhone 4s or even PSPs for that matter. Um, obviously they've just taken apart, but it's nice to see. Last but not least. The iPhone 5. I love it. These are quite expensive coming in at around about 150 to 180 dollars, depending on what smartphone you want or what handheld you want. Like they go all the way back to the original iPhone, should you want that. And they even have like the iPhone 3GS and the iPhone 3G, which I thought was pretty cool. But my favorite has to be the PSP. So there's not really much to it because it's simply an unboxing, but I thought I'd showcase you these awesome pieces of art. And my favorite has to be the PSP 1000, which you can pick up in the links below. They are fairly expensive, but they do make for a nice piece of art in your living room, your home, your office, or your gaming space. And it's a nice way to take old broken hardware and turn it into a piece of art for us to, you know, bring back those old memories of when times were a little bit less stressful. So there you have it, there are links below if any of you are interested, and I hope to see you in the next video. Peace.